Ever since Update 9 dropped and we found out that new Hot Wheels cars were exclusively being added into wheel spins, I've been getting hit with the same question over and over. How do you get your wheel spins so fast? What's the easiest way to get them? And that's exactly what I'm going to show you here today in this video. I'm going to explain my method in detail. It's 100% legit, no cheats, no exploits. And it's what's allowed me to open over 600, maybe 700 wheel spins during multiple live streams over the last week. The first thing you need is an optimal car. Best one hands down is the gameplay you're seeing and I've talked about it, the Hoonicorn V2. Why? Because it has an 8x skill multiplier and obviously is super easy to just hoon around in. I do use it bone stock, the only problem is though this car is an exclusive that not everyone has, so of course, I have an honorable mention for you, an auto show car, the Hoonigan RS200. This car has a 7x multiplier, and regardless of which car you have and use, you want to make sure you have the extra life perk activated, along with all the other perks that give boosts to skill score. Now the other thing that's great about this method is I at least actually find it to be fun. It's not really just a grind. All you have to do is hoon around and get ultimate drift skills, wreckage skills, and everything else in between. I do recommend going to Horizon Life Online because there's a lot less traffic, but regardless, just make sure you have that extra life perk on so you can make a mistake and not lose your chain. You might notice I stopped around 43,000 skill score and was just letting my skill kind of build up and bank. The skills fall way behind and your score is usually way higher than what it's actually showing on your screen. The reason I stop is because the amount of skill points you can get in a single skill chain is 10. So to be clear, the skill points are what you use in the car mastery to buy perks. Now you might not know this, but every 50,000 skill score gives you one skill point. Now with the 8x multiplier on the Hoonicorn V2, you need 62,500 skill score in your chain to get exactly that 500,000 goal. I made a little chart to show you how much skill score you need based on the multiplier the car you're using might have. Obviously, the higher the multiplier, the faster you're going to get this done, which is why I use the V2 and recommend it. But the RS200 is a great second option. I also want to point out, you can start a race event on the highway, and this will bank your chain immediately, but I don't really like doing this just because you don't always know exactly where your score's at. You might be short of 500,000 a little bit, which will only give you 8 or 9 skill points. But it certainly is much quicker if you're 100% sure you're past the score that you need to get the 10 skill points. The best scenario is getting skill songs. So make sure you have your radio on. You'll get a 10 times multiplier regardless of the car that you use, which is a fantastic boost whenever it happens. Because you only need 50,000 skill score at that point. But now you know everything there is to know about skill score and how to get skill points fast. But why are we earning them? Well, there's a car in this game that has still two super wheel spins and a regular wheel spin in its car mastery. That is the Zenvo TSRS, the Flappy Wang. This is the cheapest and best auto show car for getting wheel spins through the car mastery now. You want to rapid buy these through the car collection. Of course, the only limitation is the car is 1.2 million credits. But each TSRS that you buy will give you two supers and one regular wheel spin. It'll cost 21 skill points per car mastery to buy all the required perks. So if you max out your skill points, you can do this almost 50 times. This will leave you with hundreds of wheel spins, but also keep in mind the max skill points you can save up to is 999. So make sure you start spending them once you get to that point because you cannot save them past that. But there's no limit to this, you can do this method as much as you want to. If you want wheel spins and want to try to get those new Hot Wheels cars early, this is the way to do it. I really hope that everyone finds this video to be helpful or useful. If you have any questions at all, just let me know in the comment section. But as always, thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to smash that like button. I'm out, I will see you on the next video.